boom. It's your boy, F-E-D. Black Earth Discussion. That nigga fed. Uncle fed. Nah, man, check this out. This Uncle Granddad. Look, I'm gonna get into the, uh, his best friend shit and how all these people tie in. These true religion people, you know what I'm saying? Zari Walls, the best friends and shit. Uncle Nika Jenkins. Let's get into it. First, we're gonna get into these time stamps. You see this Irene live. And he said she went live around 11 30. 11 36? September 8th from Monifo's phone. Right? Right? We can't forget these points, man. You know what I'm saying? And this is Ty Rollins live. He went live at 12 43 a.m. You dig what I'm saying? But you see those two names over down there, John John Williams, the other one said he's from Jamaica. And, and, uh, and this guy right here. But check his friends this right quick. Brianna Kai and see what I'm saying? It's the same players, bro. You gotta watch that children girl. She on her twice. That children girl starting to catch my eye as I look through the shot town streets. You feel what I'm saying? Uh oh, Irene Roberts. Huh? That's right. It's it's the same thing. You know what I'm saying? It come your boy. You'll tie them and the rest of all of them. That was in their room. Uh, compliments of goddamn Irene Rollins. Monifa Shelton. You see, it's always the same little crew, man. Oh, Shaw Harris and Tasha Mack. You know about Lily Mack. It's the same name, man. So, you can't tell me these people don't know something. So, it's just gang, gang. No face, no case. But, for the people out here that are still wondering and want to know what's going on, told y'all about the restaurant, the club, the theater is down in <coughs> Rosemont, but it's something about Rosemont in that 911 call that's making me think that we need to be looking at that Crown Plaza in the West Loop. What's that? What kill that? Oh, Lee Mack, Lee Lee Mack, oh, Ty Thomas, little Ty. You dig what I'm saying? Man, it's playing it's right in our face, man. We just gotta use our thinking caps, man. And uh do more digging off into the people who can pay these people to do such things. If you can think in your head that they done did some some wicked shit, who would be the paymasters to give them the money to do what they doing, bro? And keep covering it up by way of not wanting to be a snitch. By way of not wanting to lose their life. You understand? How does the Crown Plaza. Uh oh. Who that is? Adriana Mays. How does the Crown Plaza. In the West Loop. Down there. Downtown Chicago. Tie in. You know that was Zach was killed there. How does that tie in. To this case. Is that the other set? Is that the other set? Asia Kimball, Asia Kimball, Lil Kimball Lou, I think she has a uh, potential to be Kimball Lou. Now let's get into Zari. You see Zari Walls right here? August the 28th, Kanika's, ooh, this is supposed to be Kanika's best friend right here, always from Wisconsin and everything, you dig what I'm saying? Is that the real Tyrone? Before he got a little slim, but how could he get that slim? In a couple of days, from August the 28th to, to, to September, you see that Zara Wall said, Rest easy. She telling herself to rest easy. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. She telling herself to rest easy. She putting this page to rest. I don't know how this little shit go to these little Facebook pages and, pages and what they be doing, but she putting herself to rest right here, telling herself to rest easy. Peep the friends. You see that little one down in that corner? Marvin Porter Jr., yeah, he's a mortician. And I wonder, do he let Zari do the hair on some of the cadavers that come through? I don't know. Is, is Zari supposed to be the one that did Monifa's hair? Because I think Marvin Porter Jr., who works at AGB on the side, is a part owner of a mortuary. And I think it's the mortuary that supposedly did Kanika up. You 
know the dress rehearsal, remember? And one thing Marvin Porter said when I investigated him, he said he hadn't spoke much on the on the case of the young girl that died in the freeze, but he can say one thing. That is not her in those videos, meaning the ones that came off the news. He the mortician. Go back and check him out. Marvin Porter Jr. And everything I say on my video, man, everything is a legend. Dumb roll to the drum roll. Why is she sitting out there? Why can't nobody go straight to her grave and show her headstone? They want to show all the headstones around the surrounding area, but they won't go straight to her headstone. Bag up, bitch. Bag up. You just pass by and bag up. That's I just keep going. But we're going to get to the point about these two having the matching rings. And it's the ring that, it's the ring that Brianna Garrett come up with. The same ring that Kanika had. Or was it three rings? But I know when they made one, they made a me. But I'm talking about in this little circle, in this little group. Because one thing I understand is Zari. Wasn't you the one that Kanika supposed to be going to the movies, having dinner and going to the movies with? So you would have been that closest inside source to let everyone know how the plan was playing out. How did Ty Rowling know which movie? Y'all could have been going to the movie down in Rosemont. They got a theater. Was you the inside source? To tip off Ty Rowland to go to the movies just in case Monifa calling her over and over again didn't work. Were you the one that was giving the intel? Huh? I'm out of here, y'all. Boom.